But hey, welcome inside of Allegiant Stadium. Just two home games remaining for the Silver and Black this season. And you know what? If they want to get to the second season, which of course is the playoffs, they got to just win, baby. That's what the late, great Al Davis used to say. And today they had the AFC West foes, the Denver Broncos in the house. And you know what? There's a lot of orange inside of Allegiant Stadium here today. The first time that Bronco fans actually get a chance to see their team play here inside of the Death Star. And you know what? To start off this game, the Raiders would adhere to the motto of just win, baby, because they were playing pretty well. No score second quarter when the Raiders go on a nice, a clean 14-play, 76-yard drive, and it was led by Derek Carr. He found Zay Jones in this for a nice 15-yard pickup. Then the drive would end with a beautiful, and I mean beautiful, 10-yard touchdown pass from Carr to Hunter Renfro. 7-0, the Raiders were up and in complete control in this game until the wheels would fall off the REO Speedwagon. First, it's Josh Jacobs carrying the ball like a loaf of bread. You don't want to do that. He just drops the ball, fumbles it. That would lead to a Broncos field goal. The Silver and Black are now up just 7-6. to six. Next Raiders possession, Carr tries to throw the screen pass, puts a little bit too much touch on it, and he throws the screen directly to Bradley Chubb. Uh, Chubb plays for the Broncos. Chubb would run it down to the one-yard line, and then the first play from scrimmage for the Broncos, they would get the touchdown. So, in a matter of, what, two minutes, the Raiders go from being up 7-3 to three and dominating the first half of this game to being down 13-7 to seven at the half and heading into the locker room to booze from Raider Nation here at the Death Star. All right, third quarter, Raiders come out with a new attitude. Nine plays, 75-yard drive, and much of it was Josh Jacobs just atoning for his earlier fumble. Eight yards, eight yards, 20 yards, eight yards. Seven rushes in total in this drive for Josh Jacobs, but it would end with Peyton Barber getting the glory and scoring the touchdown from five yards out. 14-13, to 13, the Raiders were up. Now, after a nice Bronco drive, they were looking to get the lead. Brandon McManus is... 55-yard field goal, no good. So the score is still 14-13, to 13, the good guys. So the Raiders get the ball right where that missed kick was at, and they get in position for a Daniel Carlson 41-yard field goal. That is good. So it's 17-13, to 13, the Raiders are up. Now, after a really nice defensive stand by the Raiders, who played well on that side of the ball all game long, they get it back with 354 left, and the silver and black, they run the clock out. They run the clock out on a beautifully designed third and two pass from Carr to Foster Moreau. That would really get that drive to end the game. The Raiders beat the Broncos 17 to 13. Josh Jacobs has his best game of the season by far. 27 rushes, 129 yards. The Silver and Black improved to eight and seven with a gutsy effort, all because of Jacobs and the Silver and Black on defense. Oh, yeah, we'd all like to play with anger and we'd like to play with edge. And Josh does that when he carries the football. We certainly weren't happy with the way the first half ended. Right? We turned the ball over twice, put our defense in a bad situation, and, and um, the results were what they were. So I thought we had a good halftime adjustment, um, came out and had the ability to run the football in the second half. And then obviously our defense responded again with great energy and great effort and gave us the ball at, uh, at times where we could go do something with it. Yeah, when he's not talking, that means he's rolling. Well, that would do it for sports. Make sure you tune in to 10 on the CW, 11 o'clock on News 3. But sports night tonight, we will have more on the Silver and Black's big win with myself and Jesse Merrick. But for now, that's all I have from the Death Star. Let's get it back to you.